And we went back to September to look at, you know, the start of our rainy season, really. And the only months that were above average, and they weren't above average by much, I mean a quarter of an inch, November, December, the rest of them were awful. What really let us down was January, February, and March, each month about an inch below average. Now we're at 73, still warm for this time of year. Winds are dead calm, humidity 16%. We've got 66 in Porterville. That's one of the cooler spots, but most of us are warmer than that. Taft is doing great, and it's only 46 into Hatchby. Winds not a concern at this hour, but they will be tomorrow afternoon again as those easterly winds kick up, possibly gusting to 40 miles per hour at the extreme end. And that's until 8 p.m. tomorrow afternoon, or evening, I should say, with the red flag warnings continuing for the Southland. It's going to be a tough weekend. This area of low pressure is going to move in this direction and then park itself offshore starting on Saturday into Sunday. And that'll cool us off and get us out of this mess. 95 was the high today. 80 is the average, in case you're wondering. But not a record. The record was 101, set back in the 40s. 91 in Porterville today. Wasco got to 96. 86 at Lake Isabella and 73 into Hatchapi. Down south, look at this. Camarillo, where the fire is, 98 degrees with no humidity, really, and 95 in Paso Robles. That kind of fire there can erupt just about anywhere with all that brush and a bad rain season for the Southland, too. Downtown LA got to 88. It was 80 in San Diego. Very warm, high pressure, dominates the weather for one more day, then things will start to change. Our winds will be easterly, and then when we get to late Friday into Saturday, you'll see the winds shift out of the north a little bit, and that'll change the air mass up a little bit and get us a little more moisture in the air, but no rain. 68 for Lake Tahoe, 93 in Fresno tomorrow, 75 for San Francisco. Another nice day there. Down south, if you're traveling for the weekend, it'll be warm but cooler into the weekend. 84 for Santa Barbara on Friday, 75 for Pismo Beach. And down south, Los Angeles looks warm, as does Disneyland. 90s again, crazy weather. 94 for Palm Springs. It's not very often that it's warmer in downtown LA than it is in Palm Springs, but it's going to happen tomorrow. For us, low 90s again, overnight lows down to 60 in many spots. Southeast winds at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Into the mountains, it looks like this. Not bad. Temperatures going into that 80s range again. Not much change. Deserts also kind of hot, but not scorching. 80s to low 90s. Southeast winds will be gusty. Air quality goes from unhealthy to sensitive groups. Low 63, clear skies, and tomorrow's high 94. Sunny and still H-O-T. Cooler on Sunday and beyond. Slight chances of rain as well.